Eight months after the death of George Floyd, three Minneapolis City Council members are making another attempt to get rid of the Minneapolis Police Department. That is our top story. I'm Randy Meyer. And I'm Kelsey Carlson. The City Council members behind this proposal want to remove the police department and rebuild it from the ground up. Fox 9's Courtney Godfrey joins us live. And Courtney, what is the difference between this new effort and last summer's effort? Yeah, well, Randy, the city council is once again attempting a charter amendment. This year, though, they leave in wording that would allow for the option to have law enforcement officers. The ordinance being proposed by three city council members, Philippe Cunningham, Steve Fletcher, and Jeremy Schroeder, would strike the word police from the city charter altogether and eliminate a requirement to maintain a minimum number of officers based on population. But council member Schroeder says this is not abolishment. Safe and this absolutely does not get rid of police. As it's written, the amendment allows for officers but doesn't require them. That doesn't mean reducing officers. Uh, it just means uh, looking at public safety in a holistic way and seeing what is going to best keep people safe and get them the help they need. That's a change from the last time the council tried a charter amendment, but some neighbors say they don't buy it. This is still quite vague. There's still a lot of details that have to be filled in, but here's what we do know. It's going to make it easier for them to reduce the number of officers on the Minneapolis Police Department, which is ultimately their goal. Mayor Jacob Fry is against the amendment, releasing a statement tonight that specifically focuses on the move to have the council join in on overseeing a department that's historically reported to the mayor. Mayor Fry has heard community calling for safety services that go beyond policing, but he has not heard residents say we need to dilute accountability by the head of public safety reporting to 14 elected officials with divergent opinions. This proposal will be formally introduced at tomorrow's city council meeting with the goal of it getting on the November ballot for voters to decide. Reporting live in Minneapolis, Courtney Godfrey, Fox 9.